I like to articulate our theme for this year's conference on Lean Six Sigma, uh, our radar over the globe through our LinkedIn forums and our learnings from other conversation with experts with the uh, Six Sigma and the Black Belts. Everybody's talking about satisfying a customer. I know it's been an old knowledge, but it keeps on and on and on. Because if you have picked up an insight coming from the video, it says that the purpose of the business is to create customers. So everything that we do in our process and in our balance scorecard should always be gearing towards satisfying our customer. Or it's always customer-centric. And that is what we're going to learn today and how it is going to, how Lean Six Sigma methodology is integrated towards that objective. We are also a believer of lean thinking. Um, to me, um, lean methodology, one of its holy grail is really process management. So we have to see the dynamics of our process from where we are in the various phases of our project and maybe our job descriptions for us to understand the process and for us to look at the macro perspective of our company, where we are going in terms of our balance scorecards. So therefore, we have to inject Lean Six Sigma. And being lean, being lean, that means taking out the fats in our processes, taking out wastes in our processes. So we have to think lean and we have to think process. Mm. Last night, uh, we came back from this hotel, very, very tired, but I have to read something, a very important article in the World Economic Forum. You can Google it. And they have always a study every year. In fact, the last uh, World Economic Forum in Davos, Switzerland, uh, they always come up with a global competitiveness index of 144 economies around the world. And um, in this global competitiveness index, the study is um, there are 12 pillars of competitiveness in each of these countries being measured by World Economic Forum. And um, some of these index are, for example, institution, infrastructure, education, um, governance. And most of all, that is very significant to to us here as Lean Six Sigma practitioner is the business sophistication index, meaning the private sector and people who does business, how sophisticated they are in terms of doing their business. 